Welcome back to Trends and Friends. I'm joined by Rick Jones from the Post Animal Refuge Center. And for someone who doesn't know, what are you guys? We are the local shelter for Garza County that take in stray dogs and things in the area. We've been in existence nine years, and in that nine years, we've had 700 dogs adopted out through us. Wow, that's, that's impressive. That is impressive. We've also lowered the kill rate at the city pound in half. That's amazing. Because we've been working real good with them. Now, you guys have a fun event going on. It's going to be with the Old Mill Trade Days. Tell us about what the event's all about. Okay, every Old Mill Trade Days, we are out there with dogs and there. They have partnered with us to help us adopt our problem dogs. Okay, and when L you say problem, what is that? Lucky like exactly? here is what we would classify as a special needs dog. He has been in the shelter for two years now okay. because he's so timid and he does not do well in the normal adoption event. But at trade days, I can have him out in the open because we have an outside booth. He's not in a cage. He's on a leader. And there he gets to walk through the booths and the vendors and visit with everyone. And he's slowly learning that people are his friends and not going to hurt him. Well, and that's important. And a lot of these dogs have gone through some probably Tremendous shady, shady paths. It's not yes. the greatest thing. And so we want to get these dogs out because they're wonderful creatures and they need a loving they home. Are. As a matter of fact, last year I had a dog dog that was that was adopted that had been in the shelter for four years oh my goodness he was out there lady came by bonded with him she took him for a walk which we can do in that situation she took him back sat with him for a while took him home heard from him they are doing fantastic now. Wonderful. Now, is he going to be one of the dogs that's potentially he, adopted? He is my Sunday dog. I've been okay. bringing him out there every Sunday. So, Wonderful. Yes, until he Wonderful. gets adopted. Now, for the trade days, when is it going on? Where is it going on? And how long does it last? Okay, it's Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Okay. Friday and Saturday from 9 to 6, Sunday from 10 to 4. Okay, is there a cost? There's Saturday and Sunday, there's a $2 admission fee. Okay, not that's too shabby. Not too shabby, yes. Uh, there is other additional events going on this weekend. Um, on Saturday, we're, they're going to have a bounce house and a water slide for the kids nice. to play on there. I like it. And they are having a concert after the show. So if you want to come out and make it a day, you can come and do some shopping. They will have a steak dinner served Ooh. after the regular vendors close down there. Okay. And then Justin Kemp is going to be in concert there at trade days. So in the tons of fun. Tons of fun. For two dollars. No, well the, the steak and the concerts and a little extra a little extra fee and you would go on the old mill trade days website to make reservations and for that because they do need to know how many people are coming. Okay, if they wanted to call you for more information, do you have a phone number? Uh, for for the event or just for adoption? Either one. The best way to do both of them is to go onto the website okay. and all the contact information there. For Old Mill Trade Meals, it's oldmilltradedays.com. Old for park, it is postanimalrefuge.com. Perfect. Thank you so much for joining us today. Should be a really fun event and a lot of dogs in need of a loving home. Mm. So maybe go find your new family member. Coming up, details on Lubbock Parks and Recreation's movie night in the park. That's next.